Hi guys, I'm Nagata Chun, and welcome to my reaction for Akatsuki no Yona, episode 9. So previously we had a very sweet moment between Yun and Ixu... Or what was his name? <laughs> it was like really, really cool. I really, really like that backstory. It was kind of wholesome, kind of really, really sad. And we learned more about our characters. So now uh, Yun, Yon, is traveling with Hag and Yona, so they have like one more person, which might actually be good, because how like uh, resourceful y Yun is. Yeah, he would be definitely very helpful. Because Yona for sure needs a lot of people on her side. So I kind of don't have an idea where, on what the story will be focusing now. And I should probably just start to see. So starting it right now. Okay. What is he looking at? A secret account? Illegally managed? What are you talking about? What do you mean? Damn. Hmm. He didn't do anything about that. Yeah. People were taking advantage of that. Well, that's not nice. Why? Mmm. Dad. So he was interested in the story. Why is it? Mm, he's really trying to work this country up. No matter what. I mean, I kind of understand where he is going. But it's difficult. So, there was some tax problems, so... And corruption. Yeah, maybe the previous king should have done something about that. Was he, like, just blindly trusting people? Hmm... Difficult. Very difficult. There is kindness and kindness. Right. Okay. I'm so genuinely interested. <laughs> so genuinely interested. What they will be doing now. She can resolve. Okay. Well, <laughs> things happen. Do we have some spare names? Okay. And stories? Yeah, I was thinking that. <laughs> it was a good plan. They need to be extremely careful. Good plan. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you kinda do. Hmm. 
yeah, very bad news, especially for those two. Okay, so now they are searching for them. Hmm, they are just spread out. I assume. Ah, so he knows location on one of them. Okay. Okay, that might be helpful. So they're just kind of living... Yeah. A long journey. You should avoid it. Yeah, but there is a lot of danger, probably. He's excited. <laughs> yeah, and probably a little bit sad because he's missing him. It would be cool if but him and Pris would be traveling. Yeah, just walk casually. Don't be suspicious. Oh. Yeah, she's been kind of stuck in the palace, so why not? She gone. Be careful. You're not listening. But yeah, there were like supposed to be kind of a lot of wars or fightings, right? Looks nice. Mm. At least now she's realizing all of that. That's important for growth. Cute. Okay. Yeah, they definitely need a lot of things. Too many people around. Well, he just doesn't want to leave them. <laughs> Even for a second. He's so worried, which I get, that it's like a lot of people. <laughs> Someone might see something or say something, right? <laughs> At least no, now she's not there all alone. So weapons, hmm? Hmm. Bows are cool. That might work. Come on, Hawk. She needs it for herself. Yeah, people are talking about it. Makes sense. He is handsome. No. Well. Yeah, because what they decided on. He didn't want to do that, but. It's not easy to listen to this kind of conversations at all. Just don't draw any suspicion. 
Come on. Girl. Yeah. Don't be suspicious. But I get it, like this kind of talk. Yeah, maybe hide. <laughs> you don't want to meet these people. Soldiers. They would definitely know. Probably. Highly probably. Okay, just friendly chat. Was it Huck? Or someone else? Hard to tell. What are you trying to do, Anima? Why are you doing it? She could have shouted in a being scared you just don't sneak behind people like that <laughs> no she just ran away they were kind of cool but i get it like the stuff they were talking about it it's kind of hard for her hearing this kind of stuff because it made her think about it again Oh. Oh. I mean, that definitely sounds good for the people. Depends what he wants to do, right? As a new king. What are his goals? He would definitely need a favor of people, if he would be clever. Okay, traveling. These still shots are pretty nice, <laughs> even if they're just a still shots. Do you? Yeah, don't be too confident. I really like Hag. He is very good at this. Yeah, she wants. Come on, Hag. She needs it. She really needs it. That is not a question. She needs it. At least to be able to defend herself. But, yeah. That's a question for later. She seemed very determined. She was very determined. Yeah, it's still better than nothing. Yeah. Come on, Hawk. Come on. But I get it, it feels like he is there to protect her. It's his responsibility. So watching his back, not bad. <laughs> mm. He doesn't want to do that. Yeah, but like we are now in this kind of situation. She just doesn't want to watch you fight and getting hurt. She wants to help you. Because then she would feel like a boulder around your leg. Oh, that's a first step. Exactly that. <laughs> oh, okay. I mean. It's a 
It doesn't happen overnight. But come on, this is not l teaching someone. Come on. Show her better. You are not a really good teacher. <laughs> yeah, he's not a good teacher. Come on. I mean, yeah, doing this is not easy. Draw a bow. Need some strength. Okay. Yeah. Practice. Practice and get that feeling. It will take some time, but it's important. Mm. It's good that she's so determined. She's really giving it all. I like it. She's practicing. That's a good thing. She's getting the gist of it. Because she's practicing it. It looks delicious. <laughs> I'm hungry. Her hands. Good, that shows that she's really doing a lot. Exactly. They are not, most of the time. They need to do everything. Yeah, he's immensely strong. But she's learning a lot, I like it. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, she raised it. Well, he was too idealistic. He might have a good idea, but look what happened. Then learn better. But I'm glad that she's realizing all these things. It's very important. This is extremely important. It's okay to feel bad, but she has resolve. Okay. Good. Stop sounding so condescending. He's very skilled. Yeah. <laughs> At least she's shooting. He is very good. Yeah. You need to fire the arrow with Real thought.
Okay, something just triggered her. <laughs> Maybe that's a good stuff. Well, it's rough, but what else you can do if there are for zeros, which would probably kill you without hesitation. It's his job to protect you, right? Yeah, and it's hurting him <laughs> that she's talking like that because he still doesn't think she likes him. I mean, she doesn't, I don't know, she probably doesn't like him in that kind of way, but it's hurting him because he likes her. So when he hears these kind of things, it's it's kind of triggering him. Okay, are there? Are they already there? Oh my! That's truly a mysterious fog. What? 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 Oh. Yun. Okay, Yun. Be careful. Huh? Okay, they are very secretive and they don't really like outsiders. Which I guess makes sense. I mean, it's a good tactics. <laughs> very good tactics, right? Fuck, scaring people. Ooh, they are archers. Who are you? Elves? <laughs> Yeah, they are just like not for the outsiders. Okay, they finally noticed. Red hair doesn't seem to be very common. Okay, guardians. Okay. This might be good. Is this him? I assume. Okay, we progressed. A lot, actually. So, skipping this. Is there some post Chrissy? No, this is it for next time. Okay. Okay, I'm going to give this episode seven and a half out of a ten. Um, we kind of learn a little bit about how the reign of previous king was. There were people kind of using his kindness, which yeah, that just happens. And the king kind of wasn't aware of that, I assume. Which is sad. I guess he blindly trusted people around him. But like, yeah, that's when things go sour sadly and apparently he wants to like the new king blondie wants to decrease the taxes i mean it's just what the people say right probably wish and hope for i mean he might do that which would be really really good stuff people then would really love him and he needs favor and like he really needs the people of his country loving him because that gives him strength as a king right because when the people loves you they would be able to do a lot of things for you yeah so we'll see if he's really going this smartly about that and you know decided to learn uh archery which is really good she definitely needs that and she was very dedicated despite it was like very short 
I really like that. Even like her reasoning. And even though Hyde really did not want that, I mean, I understand he is a bodyguard, right? He is a soldier. So he's the one who should be protecting her. And he likes her, he loves her. So of course he doesn't want her to fight and probably kill people. Yeah, he. I assume he probably wants her to not go through process of killing someone because that's not easy so he kind of wants her to shelter her from that but sadly it's not possible <laughs> in this kind of situation she probably would need to shoot somewhere or kill someone somewhere in the future yeah and like her attitude the fact what she said to him that she wants to protect him because she cares about him Probably still not a lot, but like she really cares about him. It's really making him hurt a lot because he doesn't want to have a hope. But even though I guess he feels like it's not possible, her saying these things is just hurting him because she's very nice to him and it's like false hope for him. Like, Stop saying these things and give like giving me false hope because I know this is not possible. That's why he's kind of annoyed, <laughs> which hurts me for him. Oh come on, I just tell her. <laughs> At least you would know if she loves you or not. But I guess he doesn't want like the relationship they have to kind of get sour because of it. I guess so far now he's satisfied with being with her damn that's a complicated stuff but i managed to get here and we're probably going to meet the first dragon okay so what is the catch i feel like there is a catch i do really feel like there is one i mean who said that he would go willingly i don't know i don't know like what do they want or what are going to do they might not agree to be with her i don't know also what happened to yun come on <laughs> i hope he's okay probably is damn and i really liked yona's progress in this episode she's very determined and i do really like her determination despite like a lot of these things are pretty new to it but she's also very adaptable which is good for survival like of course she doesn't want to kill and she was very hurt when she heard that animal and it like went away she wasn't able to kill it so it would not suffer but she knows that to survive and not to be like a dead weight for hog she really needs to learn all of this and that's sweet but yeah, she said she very much cares for him. Ah, uh, that is so sweet. And again, I really want to know what was happening with the kingdom. Yeah, what was happening there? What was happening there with the corruption? Things are starting to get very interesting. I really like it. I wonder what else they will kind of unfold. Everything what was happening in there. Probably a lot of things the previous king even didn't know about, which sucks, generally, yeah. I'm really looking forward to what kind of king Blondie would be, because so far he seems to be on a really good track. It's just, the way he kind of took on this whole kingdom is not the best in the book, right? <laughs> yeah, well, I guess that is all. Goodbye and see you next time.